Racha Tayeb with Fit Realty Services bringing you a market update for a residential Queens properties for month of December. This time we'll do a little differently. We want to look at more data. So we'll be comparing 2014, 15, 16, and 17. So four years just to see exactly new listings, average list price, sold listings, average sold price, and we're also adding days on the market, okay? So let's get to it. And keep in mind, this is residential, one to four, excluding co-ops and condos and commercial properties, okay? So in 2014, we got 227 properties on the market in December. You can see a year later, increase inventory 274. We've gone in 60 to 392, and look at what happened last month. 453 homes. So you can see it's been gradually going up in inventory, right? Let's look at average list price. So homeowners back in 14, average about 670, went this year 926,000 dollars. Pretty insane, that's almost 30% increase. Now, sold listings, very important indicator. We've got 355 sold in 14. Look at the jump to 15. 100 properties more, 455. We've had the same year, pretty insane. Same number of properties sold, 15 and 16 at 455. And look at this. So we're going up, stable, we're going down in sales. Only 402 properties sold in December last year. Now, average sold price, 619, 657, 709, and boom, 780. So again, almost 30% increase in the sold prices. So if you had bought a home for $100,000, 2014 right now is about $130,000 now, so 30% in equity. Days on the market pretty much the same, 91, 79, 82, and 80. So what do we see? We see uh, much more homes available on the market. So for sellers, that means you really gotta make sure you list the property the right way. I'll give you a quick example. Last couple of months, we've had three properties on the market when two of the sellers had decided to go a little higher than the market value while one homeowner had decided to go right at the market value. What happened is the homeowner who had decided to go right at the market value sold and went on the contract in less than a month. The other two properties, one of the homeowners decided to adjust to the market and had got on the contract two weeks later with the multiple offers. The third seller decided to stay at the above the market value and it's still sitting on the market. So the pricing is crucial, okay? For the buyers, you've got more properties to look at, but higher prices. Now, any other questions about any market in particular in order to reach us, God bless everybody. Talk to you soon. Bye-bye now.